What's up, art and science enthusiasts? Today, we're tackling a classic, the compound microscope. If you've ever struggled to draw this essential piece of lab equipment, this is the video for you. We're going to make it easy and fun. So, clear your workspace, grab your drawing tools, and let's get sketching. Okay, so let me describe each of the labeled parts of the microscope shown in the diagram. Eyepiece, ocular lens. This is the lens closest to your eye when you look through the microscope. Its primary function is to magnify the image produced by the objective lens, usually by 10x or 15x. Eyepiece tube. This is the cylindrical tube that holds the eyepiece in place at the top of the microscope. It's often a fixed component, but in some models, it might be adjustable for different interpupillary distances. Body tube. This is the main tube that connects the eyepiece to the objective lenses. It serves as a light path, ensuring that the light from the specimen travels directly from the objective lenses to the eyepiece without interference. Objectives lens. These are the primary magnifying lenses located on the revolving nose piece just above the stage. Microscopes typically have several objective lenses of different magnifications, e.g. 4x, 10x, 40x, 100x, which can be rotated into position to change the total magnification. They are responsible for collecting light from the specimen and forming the first magnified image. Fine adjustment. This is a small, typically inner knob used for making precise, minute adjustments to the focus. It's especially crucial when using high-power objective lenses, e.g. 40x, 100x, to achieve a sharp, clear image, as even a slight movement can blur the view. Course adjustment. This is a large, typically outer knob used for making large, rapid adjustments to the focus. It moves the stage, or the body tube, up and down quickly. It's used for initial focusing, especially with low-power objective lenses, to bring the specimen into approximate focus. Stage. This is the flat, horizontal platform where the microscope slide containing the specimen is placed for viewing. It usually has stage clips to hold the slide securely in place. Some stages are mechanical, allowing for precise movement of the slide. Mirror. Located beneath the stage, this component is used to reflect ambient light or light from an external source upwards through the specimen and into the objective lens. In more modern microscopes, this is often replaced by a built-in light source or illuminator. Arm. This is the curved or angled part that connects the head, containing the eyepiece and objective lenses, to the base of the microscope. It's the part you grasp when carrying or moving the microscope, providing stability and support for the upper optical components.